stable, secure, affordable, window eyes. Welcome to another GW Micro How Do I Do That presentation. Today's presentation is going to talk about Microsoft keystrokes versus window eyes keystrokes. You may not be aware, but many of the hotkeys or keystrokes that you use on a daily basis are likely Microsoft keystrokes. What does it mean when we talk about a Microsoft keystroke versus a window eyes keystroke? Well, a Microsoft keystroke can be used regardless if window eyes is running. So if I were to actually close window eyes, that keystroke will still function because it's actually built into Windows or built into an application. For example, you may be familiar with Windows key and the letter D, as in dog, to be able to access the desktop. That's actually a Microsoft keystroke, meaning regardless if Window Eyes is running, that keystroke will still work. So if I press Windows key and the letter D now, Recycle bin list view one of nine. I've now been taken to the recycle bin on my desktop. If I were to shut down Window Eyes, I could still use Windows key D, meaning this keystroke works all the time. It's not specific to Window Eyes. Let's talk about how this may work in an application. I'm going to open up Microsoft Word. The way that I typically do that is I open up the Run dialog. So I'll press Windows key and the letter R to bring up the Run dialog. By the way, that's a Microsoft keystroke. It will work regardless of Windows Eyes is running. Open O combo edit box. I'll dialog type in Run. I'll type in WinWord. W I N W O R D. And press Enter. Desktop. Recycle bin list view one of nine. Document one Microsoft Word. Section one of and one style. I just tapped the Control key to silence that. So far, of the keystrokes we pressed, the only one that's been specific to window eyes is control to silence speech. All of the other keystrokes that we have pressed have been Microsoft keystrokes. I'm going to use a Microsoft command that you don't need to be familiar with, but I'm going to generate some text here inside of Microsoft Word. Equals R A N D left pair five comma five right pair. And text has just been generated inside of Word, so I'm going to go press Control Home to get to the top of this document. That's a Microsoft keystroke that moves our cursor to the top of the document. Again, not a Window Eyes keystroke. So Control Home. Top of document. On the Insert tab, the galleries include items that are designed to coordinate with the overall look of. So we've talked a lot about these different Microsoft keystrokes. Well, what about a Window Eyes keystroke? If I want to read this document, for example, if I want to start reading this document from where the cursor is to the end of the document, I can press Control Shift R. That is not a Microsoft keystroke. That's a Window Eyes keystroke, meaning it only works when Window Eyes is on. So if I press Control Shift R, on the Insert tab, the galleries include items that are designed to press coordinate control. with the. I press Control to silence that. Control Shift R is a Window Eyes keystroke. Other common keystrokes you may be familiar with that are Microsoft keystrokes. Control N. Let's try that. Control N is Nancy. New document. Microsoft Word. Style normal page. And I press Control to silence that again. Control N creates a new document. That's a Microsoft keystroke. Control S to save a document. A Microsoft keystroke. Other examples would be when you're using the web and you want to access the address bar. Alt D is in dog. That's a Microsoft keystroke. Microsoft does a really good job of building in a lot of functionality with the keyboard to try and make it as easy as possible when using screen access technology such as Window Eyes. So if you're new to Window Eyes and you know a lot of these Windows keystrokes, don't be afraid because all of those keystrokes are going to work when you're using Window Eyes as long as they're a Microsoft keystroke. Thanks for joining us for another How Do I Do That presentation from GW Micro. For any technical support questions, you can contact our technical support department at support, S-U-P-P-O-R-T, at gwmicro.com or call technical support at 260-489-3671. Stable, secure, affordable, window eyes.